<laughs> every time. BTS performing Permission to Dance and Butter at Global Citizen Live is what I'm gonna be reacting to today. I figured why not do a double feature? Not one song, but two. Both these songs from BTS were released this year and both I have absolutely fallen in love with. So I'm so excited to watch another live performance of them. By the way, hello, my name is Cody McManus. Thank you so, so much for being here. If you enjoyed today's video and like that I'm batching a couple of them together, be sure to give this video a big thumbs up down below. It really helps me out a ton and lets me know that you enjoy these type of videos, especially putting two of them together. I could do more of that. So make sure to hit that thumbs up so I know you enjoy that. And if you want to stay up to date with more reaction of videos from me in the future, be sure to hit that subscribe button because you're not going to want to miss out. BTS has been dropping a ton of content lately. I've been sure to watch and react to it all. So if you're not already, make sure you hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out. But let's turn on these headphones because we got a bit of a longer one today and I'm super, super excited for it. So we're going to start off with permission to dance and go from there. Let's not mess around. Let's get right into it. Here we go. BTS performing permission to dance at Global Citizen Live. Oh, cool. In Seoul, South Korea. Wow, what a beautiful BTS city. Global Citizen Live. Two, three, three. Welcome to Seoul, Korea. Oh, cool. Man, their outfits are sick. I like that. Oh, yeah. Oh, cool. Oh, like, that's sick. He did, They did, like, this piano dance move. Elton John, obviously known for his amazing, amazing piano skills. I Is this a bit of a different dance from what we're used to? I think they changed up some of the choreography already. I'm not sure. We'll have to keep watching. Uh, if anybody knows, let me know in the comments down below. I'm super curious. Oh, wow. Dang. Oh, look at how good Jimin looks. Oh, I paused it on the perfect frame, too. That's like a sexy Michael Jackson pose. I love the outfit. I love the attire from all of them. They're kind of going with this, like, beige-ish beige -ish type look. The pants, unreal. The brown belt and shoes are sick. More importantly, I love the jewelry that he's got on. He's got, like, this green kind of, like, emerald-looking necklace. Dang. Just really well put together. Looks great, Jimin. Way to go. Oh, all of them. Jin too. What a fit. Nice. Man, they're so good. Nice. Nice. I'm loving this performance. This is so good. Ah, every time. Ah, oh, he's so good, man. Oh, yeah. Look at this. Like, look at how they're all dressed. They all look so good all the time. And what's even more impressive is they always change it up. It's interesting. They have a few different colors. I wasn't expecting um, V and Sugar to be in this blue. That's kind of like off what everybody's going with. But I like it. It's really cool. Also, Jin's outfit's cool. The top button is such a thing. I love that. He's got a like undershirt underneath. I don't know. The guys uh, like look so, so good in this performance. I absolutely love it. The backdrop is amazing. That just screams uh, South Korea, Seoul. You know, like obviously they're 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 showing off where they're from and and who they are. I love that. I think this is so sick. Nice. Ah, the moves are so good. Ah, <laughs> run. <laughs> Gets me every time. Sick. 
smooth. Ah, oh, so smooth. I love that ad lib. That seriously has to be one of my favorite BTS ad libs I've ever heard. It's it's not crazy or anything, but it just it it's after this dramatic part where all the music sucks out, it's kind of this a cappella. You just got like some some basic rhythmic elements to keep the song going. And Jimin just pops out with his super clean, super simple ad lib, and it sounds so good. I love it. I love it so much. Let's <laughs> and JK, my guy. Wow. Amazing. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Was that sung? That sounded like a backing track ad lib. I didn't see, let's, I don't think anybody sings that. I could be wrong because I know they sing so many parts. Like they sing pretty much everything, but that sounded very backing track. I just want to see if I can, it's got to be JK if he's singing it. Yeah, I don't think that's sung. Man, these guys are so impressive. Oh, yeah, that's a good one. Holy. Oh, I love that. Dang. Wow, these guys are so amazing. Everything they do just blows me away. Like, they are the most talented musicians in the world, and there's seven of them, which is even more impressive. I I love BTS so much. They're so good. Okay, let's move on. Are there any comments on this? Yeah, no comments. What the heck? Why do they block comments? Guys, I love the comments. If you got a comment and you wanted to comment on this video, but you couldn't say it, drop it on mine. Go ahead right now. Drop a comment down below. Anything you want to say. Comments aren't open on the... Is there comments for butter? Yeah, no, no comments. So guys, all the comments can be on this video. Feel free. Anything you want to say about the performance that you weren't able to say in these comments, drop it down below. I'll do my best to try to get back to everybody and reply. I get a ton of them, but I try to spend a few hours as soon as the video comes up. So if you're one of the first to watch this video, if you watch within the first day of it, coming out. Good chance. I'll read your comment. I'll try to give it a like. I'll try to reply to it if I can. So yeah, drop a comment. But let's move on to Butter because this is actually the first song that I ever listened to from BTS. So it holds a special place in my heart. If you haven't seen my reaction to Butter, very first time ever, ever listening to BTS, I'll link it up here. Feel free to go check it out. But let's not mess around and let's jump right into it. Butter from BTS at Global Citizen Live. Oh yeah, right into it. Smooth like butter, like criminal undercover, gone. Wow, you can hear so much of the venue through their vocals, which is so cool. You can hear the echo of the sound going through and coming back into their mic. That is that is awesome. I, I don't know where this is. Uh, if anybody knows where they're performing this, let me know. New outfits too. Oh, break it down. I love this. Whoa, in the streets? Okay, BTS can actually do anything they want. They're like, hey, we want to shut down this major street in Seoul uh, to perform our song Butter. Is that cool? And they're like, yeah, of course. What do you need? Should we go set up some lights in the background? Make this like super extra? And they're like, yeah, that's probably a cool idea. And then they go ahead and they bust this. Man, what can't BTS do? Oh, V, sounding good. Yeah. <laughs> that is such an amazing run that he does there. On top of it all, he's doing a spin, not the craziest choreography, but still, just the movement in your body naturally makes it hard to sing those parts because it's not going with the rhythm of the song or with the notes that you're supposed to sing. So it's so impressive that JK is able to pull that off. He's so, so good. Nice. Wow. 
Oh, look at that light show behind them too. This this is such an amazing setup. This is one thing I love about BTS. Their live performances are always just so top notch, so extra. They're not afraid to take it off the stage and do some crazy performance like this in the middle of a city, which is so cool. Uh, over on my Patreon, I watch a ton of like the docu series of them on tour. I've watched Burn the Stage. I watch Burn the Stage the movie. Uh, currently watching Bring the Soul, and I have no plans of stopping anytime soon. So if you guys want to check that out, it's the first link down below. But I love getting a look into how they set up their performances, the little, how they pay so close attention to every small detail. And I know it's the same thing when they put on a performance like this. They're like, how can we show off us as global citizens, but still showing where we came from? And they do that by showing off the highlight of Seoul, South Korea, which I think is so, so amazing. They just, they're, they're so talented. BTS is so great. <laughs> Yeah. Oh yeah, nice dance break. Okay, another thing that I just want to throw out. These guys are always wearing the craziest outfits. Oh, they're just like they're just about to spell army. Uh, so, like, I paused at the right time. Uh, but not only are these guys like singing and dancing, but look at the outfits that they're wearing. I mean, like so many of them, they're they're all in full sleeves, basically wearing like suit jackets. I don't know if you ever worn a suit jacket, but those things are not the coolest outfits. They're warm. You can't move around in them too well. I'm sure these guys got very well made clothing that allows them to be able to dance in it. But still, just the fact that they can perform like this and not overheat in the matter of minutes is so, so amazing and that they still perform it so well. BTS, so good. I love that they spell ARMY, by the way. Oh, yeah. Oh! Jin Min! Okay, I know everybody in the comments on my videos always like Jungkook does all the ad libs and stuff and like that's his thing. But I've noticed with permission to dance and butter, Jimin is taking a huge, huge role in doing all of these ad libs, all these kind of like cool backing parts. And I think it's super cool. Obviously, Jungkook is an amazing vocalist. Jimin also an amazing vocalist. But I love that they kind of are starting to utilize two different ad lib styles and two different like vocal harmonies and like additional backing vocals. I think it's really, really cool. And then how they throw it all together live is just so good. It's this amazing amazing like non-stop vocal performance from all seven of them and it's great one of the reasons why i love this you know we don't stop like, no. that's a cool like shirt by the way we gonna make you rock and he say hey. we gonna make you bounce and he say hey. hotter sweeter cooler daughter. get it let it go dang wow look at that look at where that is let's go let back for a sec go. That is just amazing. This end shot shows really how many people are involved in this, just what it all took, like this huge crane over here with like these cameras and lights on it, literally a shutdown street in South Korea, in Seoul. That is so amazing. Guys, what did you think of this performance? Drop a comment down below, anything. I just wanna know, uh, unfortunately there's no comments allowed on this video, so let me know what you guys thought about this in my comments down below. If you enjoyed this video from me, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. More importantly, if you enjoyed me doing two videos in the same video, uh, I just think it's it's more fun, you know? I'm sitting down to do it. Why don't we just watch a few more all at once? So if you guys like that, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. And if you want to stay up to date with more BTS-related videos, more BTS reaction videos from me, be sure that you hit that subscribe button because you're not going to want to miss out when I post my next video. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this a ton. I know I sure did. And I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Thanks so much for watching. Peace.